Hi, I'm Charlie Ice with the C2000 product marketing team, and today I'm going to introduce to you two new motor control kits from Texas Instruments, the single axis motor control developers kit and the dual axis motor control developers kit. As you've probably guessed by now, the single axis features one motor and the dual axis features two motors. Both of these kits include a motor control baseboard as well as software that allow customers to run power factor correction and two, uh, control up to two motors using just one Piccolo microcontroller. These kits include everything you see here, two motors, up to two motors, a baseboard, Piccolo micro, a Piccolo control card, a power supply, a 24 volt DC power supply, a free 32 kilobyte code size limited version of Co Composer Studio, as well as detailed example software and hardware schematics such as Gerber files, etc. Everything is included with the kit here. It's designed to allow customers to get up and, and spinning two motors using sensorless field-oriented control in under 10 minutes. So right out of the box, with no additional hardware, motors can be spinning and controlled by the Piccolo microcontroller. So let's take a closer look at what's included in the kit. The first and key part of the kit is the motor control baseboard. This baseboard features a power factor correction stage and two motor driver stages, as well as an isolated USB JTAG port. The power factor correction stage takes 10 to 14 volts of AC input and outputs up to 24 volts of regulated DC output. It's actively controlled by the Piccolo microcontroller and is capable of outputting up to 100 watts of power. This power factor correction stage can actually be completely bypassed and the board can take a DC input here. The board takes all, draws all the power that it needs to power the Piccolo microcontroller and the motor driver stages from either the power factor correction stage or the DC input. These two motor control stages are actually based around TI's high performance analog. At their heart is the DRV8402 chip. This chip is a single chip, 36 pin package, um, high efficiency motor driver chip. It's designed to have an efficiency of up to 96% and output up to 250 watts of power. So it's a pretty powerful little chip. And there's actually two of these, one for each of the motor driver stages. Also on the motor driver stages are TI's high performance op amps, which allow very, very precise current sensing on the motor driver stages. To allow easy connection to the board and for safety purposes, the board has an isolated USB JTAG connection port. This allows customers to easily download code to the C2000 microcontroller with no additional hardware. It also has a JTAG header pin here, so customers can connect a external JTAG emulator, should they so choose, and still have the isolation provided by the stage here. The isolation is actually based all around other TI analog chips. So as you can see, this, the motor control baseboard is, at its heart, is based around TI's high performance analog and controlled by the C2000 microcontroller, which connects to the control card slot right here. Also included in the kit is the Piccolo microcontroller control card, which easily fits into the socket on the motor control board. The Piccolo microcontroller included is the F28035, which, among other things, runs at up to 60 megahertz and has on dual on-chip oscillators and requires only a single 3.3 volt supply to be fully functional. The F28035 also includes the new control law accelerator, or CLA. The CLA is actually an independent core which allows the inner high-speed control loops to be run completely on the CLA. And that offloads the burden of those control loops from the main CPU core and frees it to, to do other um, higher level tasks. For more information on Piccolo, please visit www.ti.com slash Piccolo. The kit also includes software. And this software runs on the Piccolo F2803X microcontroller and controls both the power factor correction stage and both motor stages all in the same piece of software, all on the same microcontroller. This, the software is actually designed, split into incremental builds, and these builds are just different levels of the software's control loops. That and what this allows customers to easily see the different stages of software development and learn about each stage as they go through. Also, the software is tuned for the motors that come with the kit as we're running sensorless field-oriented control. So, for development purposes, it's very easy to pull the software up and start spinning motors um, and these motors that are with the kit. So, right out of the box, this kit allows customers to easily spin two motors and do power factor correction using one microcontroller. 
at a very low cost. The dual axis motor control developers kit is $399, and the single axis kit is $379. So, and that includes everything shown here. For more information on these kits, please visit www.ti.com slash C2000Tools. Thank you for watching this video, and I look forward to seeing you on our next C2000 video.